let's talk about this. You give 100 people a $1,400 check. Everyone understands you can't just leave it in the bank forever because of inflation. The value goes down. Because what happens when they print trillions of dollars from the sky, the dollar becomes less valuable. And now we're living in a world right now where inflation's getting out of control, especially in America, right? In the last year, inflation's up like six, 7%. So no poor person is going to take that money and just leave it in the bank. They're going to either spend it or invest it. Let's say there's 100 poor people and the 100 poor people spend their money. What do they spend it with? Businesses. Who owns businesses? Rich people. So now each one rich person who owns a business gets 20 poor people's money. Amazon, their stock price went up 30%. Why? Because people are getting stimulus checks and spending it on Amazon. And then they go, oh yeah, but what about they invest it? Invest it where? You invest it in the stock the stock market? That increases the stock price. Who owns the company? Rich people. What if, you, what if you and all your poor friends, 200 poor friends, put all your money in together and bought one house between you? That still takes one house off the market, raises the property value of that area. Who already owns those expensive houses? Rich people. You can't stop making the rich richer. You cannot stop it. People inside the matrix don't understand what's happening.